was the night before the Iditarod and all through the lot. Not a dog was stirring, not even Cindy Abba. The booties were all packed and the dog sled were care. In hopes that the burled arch would soon be theirs. The huskies were all nuzzled in their straw. While dreaming of Roan, Safety, and Wasilla. And Cindy prepping her sled while Vern checks the map. We'll eventually settle down for a nice little nap. When out on the lot, the dogs rose to a bark. Cindy jumped from her bed to see what was out in the dark. She sprinted down the stairs. Then quickly said her prayers. Please let nothing be wrong with my dogs. We've been working and training and jumping over logs. She could not believe what she saw in the lot that was dusky. Twas a man with a dog sled and 16 great huskies. A cute little man that was friendly with everyone. She knew right away it must be Joe Reddington. So like the flash of lightning, he came. He whistled, shot a bush, and called it by name. Must Dread, must Shasta, must Brago and Tim, come G, come Hall, must Falcon and Pimp. To his little, my elf, he shall do all. We've got to help the dogs start to yell. With wheel dogs and swing dogs and even a double lead. They burst on the trail right after their feed. So out on the trail, the dogs dashed with joy. 1,049 miles to Nome. Oh boy. They stuck around bags to the Jimmy Dream dog farm. They jumped ground and held, but they caused no harm. She went back outside to see, what now? <laughs> Joe hopped out the sled, had his dogs take a bow. From head to toe, Joe was dressed in native fur. His dogs had frost on their whiskers. Oh, burn. A bag of supplies for Cindy and the boys. From booties to heat and even dog toys. He said to the dogs, this is the last frontier. Always keep Sydney Abbott riding in first gear. Willow to Yetna and safety to Nome. Run blazingly fast and then you go home. This is the last great race. You need to keep on pace. Little dogs, be careful on those turns. Keep, keep a lookout look for that red, red lantern. lantern. He looked at Cindy next. You get rest at those checks. He winked and he smiled. Uh, she thought, how wild. He jumped in his sled and yelled, one last mush. They dashed down the trail, avoiding the brush. He bellowed something back at them quite loudly. You run that I did a rat race very proudly.